Joseph here, and today I'm bringing you another video, and um, there was a new Iron Man VR trailer um, just uploaded, so I'm going to be watching that in this video. Whoops, sorry. Um, so let's just get started. Um, three, two, one. The inception of Marvel's okay. Iron Man VR all this started with the creator, and yeah, the director. Okay. Not actually, actual game. Yeah, that's not the gameplay. I don't know if it's gonna be like the same or if there's gonna be different stuff, but um sorry. Uh, creating Iron Man in yeah, VR. Who runs games came back <laughs> I, I like the Iron Man stuff in the background with the Hulkbuster and, and I said, uh, the hypothetically, and stuff. what would it take for us to get that project? And he said, Well, I have to have the best pitch I've ever seen See? and a prototype that beats On the right. every other prototype we've ever seen. Uh, and, and, and like in the middle. Three years ago, when we started Prototype Flight, um, the first thing I did was just put some three years uh, ago. Damn. on my palms in VR and see how it felt. And I remember looking over to one of the boys. He was in that prototype for like 30, 45 minutes, just playing it over and over and over again. Just <laughs> I would VR, too. Just like Iron Man, right? I would I too. At that point that we I would do the same thing. Like the demo was really cool so far. I can't wait for the full game. I, I'll probably be able to get it. If not, I'll cry. Because I'm a wuss. No. <laughs> okay, kind of. A little bit. A little bit. The complexity of how the suit animates, basically, and how it breaks apart. How it's really good. It looks really good. weapons pop out. And now it's really important to nail visually, as it's pretty much expected by the fans at this point. Stop drones incoming. I can just get close. Okay. Stark as a character is such a fun so we're going to be going there in the uh, story children. Um, I guess that's the city or whatever. Um, that part was cool, like when you uh, fix it, things. That was pretty cool. But in doing it in PlayStation VR, to be completely immersed and to be that character. And you're a ghost from your past. In a lot of ways, developing this game is really, really difficult. But in a lot of ways, developing Marvel's Iron Man VR is actually quite easy. Because whenever we got stuck, hmm. we just looked back to the source. It's machine. hard, but we it's easy. Is that what he said? The most iconic characters in the whole planet. <laughs> He's one of my favorite two heroes, honestly. Good. I have a plan to catch. That it? Yeah, okay. So there wasn't really new gameplay or anything. It was mostly just what we've seen already. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I'm really excited for the full game to come out, and let me know if you're excited for, uh, if you're excited to watch me play the full game, because, um, if I get it, which I probably will, then, um, I'll definitely play it. Um, also, hopefully I can also get, um, um, Alvo and... FNAF Security Breach. Um, hopefully they don't cost too much. Both probably um, between $10, $25, probably around there, is how much bo they're both going to cost each. Uh, I mean, um, I don't know if you guys like $50, I think. I'm not 100% sure, but I think it's about $50. Um, but the demo's free, so yeah, if you guys haven't already, go check it out. It's a it's so fun. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please have a like in the video. And if you like my other videos, please do consider subscribing. Remember to subscribe to Chicken Dude 27 Press the right dude, Don Kid Link. But I'll see you guys in the next one. The trailer was really cool. Not much new, but it was cool commentary and stuff. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Impulse event out. Peace.